attention. The following video is totally going to kick ass. If you enjoy any of it and or have a large, please click the sub and like button down below. Enjoy. I love you, Chris. God damn it, Swagmaster, shut the fuck up. Being healthy. Or the win. Sonic is my Jesus way Christ, to normal. This is an intro. Hey guys, hey. hey. We've been, been talking to a lot of people in and around the Indian animation, animation scene recently, recently and we've been, been noticing a very common and difficult problem that we've all been facing, facing. and that's funding an animated show is incredibly difficult, and making a full season is even harder. In particular, we've been talking to the folks over at Like Day. Hey Tracy, how things been? This past year, with the amazing, generous support of fans, I've been in the dream come true position of being able to develop and work on a Like Day animated series alongside a team of incredible artists. We're deep into production on season one, and nothing's gonna stop us. But as an indie show, we don't have the kind of financial backing that big studio productions have. And animation, animation takes, takes a lot of time and a lot of hands to make. So yeah, beyond crowdfunds, we know we need a long-term plan for sustaining so budget and making episodes that are as long and as great as we can envision them to be. Of course, unless we want to sell our souls to the powers that be, that means funding ourselves with merch. That's why when Glitch reached out to us and told us they were launching their own merch branch, we left at the chance to work with them. Remember, when we heard this, we wanted to help. That is why we're happy to announce that we will be partnering with them Designing, manufacturing, and distributing that much enough. Wait, Final Final Project? That isn't Glitch, Kevin. Well, yes, Luke. And also no. You see, Glitch will always be focused on making indie animation. So to make it clear, we made our own merchandise company called Final Final Project. Mascot. Final Final Project or FFP is here with one core goal and that is to make high quality merchandise for all of you guys while supporting creators how we can along the way. And I forgot what I was going to say. That's okay Luke. You have caps. Yes. That's right. Creators like Tracy should only be focusing on one thing and that's making awesome animated shows. This means we get to introduce a whole new shop and a whole new and improved line of Black Daisy merch, all while being part of Glitch's pioneering effort to make indie animation into a reliable, viable means for producing top tier internet cartoons. I just want to send out a huge thank you to Kevin, Luke, Jasmine, and the rest of the Glitch team. You've been just amazing to work with. Despite everything going on in the mainstream these days, what you're doing fills me with hope for the future of animation. So hey, if you'd like to be part of the indie revolution too, check out the cool new stuff we've introduced over at the Lackadaisy Shop. That's lackadaisyshop.com. Let's make some cartoons together. Thanks so much, Tracy. We are really excited to help you out on this, and we're looking forward to all the cool stuff we're going to make together. And if you haven't yet, please go check out Lackadaisy over on YouTube. It is an amazing pilot about gangster cats. High five. That's the end of this video, and I'll see you next time. Yeah, I have haven't never seen the um Lucky Daisy plot, all the other shorts and everything. Now my friend Cheyenne did, but like for me, however, I have never seen Lucky Daisy plot. I know a lot of you are going to hate me for that, but. Keep in mind that I haven't right. really seen the plot much of it yet. I heard a little bit of it. I just didn't much pay attention much of it because I'm I